Hi, I'm Francesca Williams with CalBears.com. This year, three Cal players were selected to the 2010 NFL Draft, and two of them went in the first round. 2010 NFL Draft, the Jacksonville Jaguars select Tyson Alu Alu. Defensive tackle, California. Defensive end Tyson Alualu was the first former Golden Bear selected in the 2010 NFL Draft first round. He was taken as the 10th pick by the Jacksonville Jaguars. It was really exciting. We had a whole team watching the draft, and when they announced Tyson's name being the 10th pick, uh, everyone was really, really excited, obviously. And couldn't happen to a better guy, a guy who's really worked to be where he is and uh, was a huge, made a huge impact on our football team. And I know that uh, Jacksonville did their homework, and they really liked him a lot, and I know he's going to be an impact player for them. The Detroit Lions select Javid Best, wow. running back, California. Running back Javid Best was also selected in the first round. He went at number 30 to the Detroit Lions. They're going to get a guy there that's very explosive, a great playmaker, a very versatile player. And uh, I think he's an every down back. And so a lot of teams will, will get guys that can only be third down backs or first down backs. But Java can do it all. He can run between the tackles. He has the speed to take it the distance at any time. He's a kick returner. He catches the ball out of the backfield as well as any receiver does. And so um, you know, I think he's so versatile they can use him on every down. The final former Cal player taken in the 2010 NFL Draft was cornerback Sidquan Thompson. He went in the seventh round to the Denver Broncos. I think going in there, I think, you know, they have a bargain with Sid in the seventh round. You know, I really believe that when he goes there for the mini camps and, and uh, they see what he can do, I think they're going to be really, really impressed with his work ethic, his instincts as a player. He, he has great instincts. He's a ball hawk. He'll go to the ball. He can make plays on the ball. But the physical part of Sid to come up and tackle, I think they're going to be really impressed. And current Cal players were very excited about this year's draft selections. Pretty awesome to see. I mean, it's every year I've been here. You see people go, and uh, they should be there. They worked hard, and uh, they're great players. And uh, I think uh, Tyson and Jod go in the first round is great. And I think Sid uh, getting drafted is awesome. But I think Sid's a great player, and uh, I think he'll prove some teams wrong by passing up, you know, some of those rounds. And, uh, Cal was the only Pac-10 school with a first-round pick in this year's NFL draft, and the Golden Bears actually had two which speaks volumes about the recruiting techniques and leadership skills at Cal. It says a lot, you know, they're recruiting quality players and uh, coaching them to the best of their ability. And, you know, every year we're sending guys into the draft and, uh, and they're going on and, you know, doing well in the NFL. So it says a lot about our coaching staff. And even if players aren't selected in the NFL draft, it doesn't mean their post-collegiate careers are over. Former safety Brett Johnson was able to impress scouts at Cal's Pro Day and landed a free agency position with the Buffalo Bills. And offensive lineman Chet Teofio, along with teammate Mike Tepper, signed free agency contract with the Dallas Cowboys. For Tepper, joining the Cowboys allows him to keep playing the game he loves. Events that have happened here have also made me mentally tough, all kind of stuff like that. It's all prepared me for this next, this next uh, chapter in my, in my journey. So uh, I'm very thankful that I chose such a great place and uh, I'm able to finish up here this semester and uh, get out of here and you know, keep succeed, succeeding in, uh, in Dallas. You know, I'm really happy for those guys who signed free agent contracts. Uh, it gives them an opportunity to go show what they can do. And having Mike Tepper and Chet Tiafilo go to the Cowboys, I know they're very excited about that. Uh, Brett Johnson had a great uh, pro day here. And that's really the evaluation format or that they get right then if you don't go to the combine. And so he did a great job. He tests very well. He's fast. He can jump. And so they obviously saw something in him that uh, they wanted to give him an opportunity. So I know he's really excited about that. Cal's draft selections, as well as their free agent signings, illustrate Cal's dominance as a football powerhouse. For CalBears.com, I'm Francesca Leaves.